In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up a physical product on the JVZoo platform. Now, to get started, once you've logged in, you'll need to go up to the Sellers tab, click on Sellers Dashboard, and then go ahead and click on Add a Product. Now, the process for setting up a physical product is pretty much the same as setting up a digital product with only some small changes. So, Obviously, as you would with a digital product, you would need to give it a product name. And then if you're going to allow affiliates to promote it, make sure that this box is checked right here to make it discoverable to affiliates. You can also choose to show it new in the public marketplace. You'll need to make sure that it follows these guidelines right here. Then you'll need to give it a description. Next, go ahead and select the category, then select your currency, and you have a number of options in here. Then go ahead and put in your product price. And if the product is ready for sale, you want to go ahead and click on allow sales. You can also choose when the product will be available for launch by selecting from the drop down calendar in here. And then you'll need to put in the commission payout percentage that you're going to pay affiliates. Next, you'll need to choose at least one of the payment options from within here. So in this case, I'll go ahead and select PayPal. And then you need to choose how you're going to approve affiliates. So you can select from this drop down area in here. Now, for the most part, it's best to manually approve affiliates. That way you can make sure you control how your product is being promoted. Make sure you put any affiliate terms in here as well as any notes. And both of these options are HTML enabled. So you can use HTML code if you so desire. Next, you'll need to complete the seller's details. So go ahead and put your information in here. So go ahead and put your support email address as well as your support URL, and then also your sales page URL. If there are any items that you need to put on the receipt, you can do it in this area. And just like with the other options, it is HTML enabled, so you can use HTML code here. OK, this is great if you're trying to make sure that you relate a note to the customer, letting them know that their purchase was confirmed, as well as what the next steps are to receive their product purchase. Now, next up, you'll need to bypass the electronic delivery and then go ahead and come down to where it says physical delivery and then go ahead and check whether or not you're planning to ship to the United States or whether you're planning to ship outside of the United States. So in this example, we'll go ahead and click on shipping within the US, and then we can put in our flat fee amount for shipping, just like that. And next, we can also choose whether or not we're interested in collecting our customer's phone numbers. So we can check this box here, and we can choose whether we want to require it at checkout or whether or not it is optional at checkout. So in this case, I'm gonna go ahead and make sure that it is required at checkout, and I'm gonna select that option. And then once we've gone through and made sure that all our other settings are correct, we wanna go ahead and click on save my product. And that's all there is to it. Now you're ready to sell your physical products on the JVZoo platform. Well, that's it for this video. Take care.